Bravo's E4473 product can do a lot of heavy lifting. However, that still left FFLs to manage all of the paper documents that accompany the sale of a firearm. Once E4473 digital storage is activated, a new option appears on our menu tree, E4473. From here, internal audits, spot checks, or checkups can happen. You will have quick access to all of the pending and incomplete 4473s, customers held up in NICS processing, you can self-audit, or create a report in ad hoc to look for the specific criteria or a transaction to add a document like we will do in this example. Selecting the drop-down arrow displays the available criteria to choose from. Let's select close date is equals to today. Here's the transaction we just completed that requires a 3310.12 form to be added. By selecting Manage Attachments, we can view what documents have already been saved to the cloud and add new ones by selecting Add. Now you can search for documents that have been scanned and need to be added. We can drag and drop, double click, or select the document then open to add. You can add unlimited documents, however once a transaction has been finalized, you cannot delete. Let's look at 4473 Audit next. First select 4473 Audit. If you're an existing Bravo customer using the Physical Inventory app, this process and workflow will look familiar. To start, we can add a new session, edit an existing session, show prior sessions, cancel an audit, complete an audit, print the list once displayed, refresh the data displayed, audit a session after we have added one, and finally review the audit sessions. In this example, we will set up an audit and start the session. First, name the session. In this example, we want to audit all of the finalized forms. Then add a close date range for the first of the month through the 15th. Last select next and then save. Now the audit menu option is available. Select audit session to get started. There is no order you must follow. Simply select a row to get started. To view all of the attachments at once, select view attachments or to view just one, double click on it. This option will open a new window and will allow for you to toggle between the 4473 form and the A&D book entry. Select Done to return to the audit screen and record your findings. Reviewed, flagged, or violation. Selecting either flagged or violation opens up a new window to make notes. If we navigate away from this transaction and back again, you will notice the Notes menu option is now highlighted. Not every transaction needs to be reviewed to complete an audit. However, once completed, it cannot be undone. That's it for E4473 Digital Storage Self-Audit. If you have any additional questions, feel free to give us a call at 888-407-6287. Thanks and have a great day.